Number four, cost benefit analysis. And if you're in business, you know what a cost benefit analysis is, but we're doing this with addictions. So you get a piece of paper and you make four quadrants. And at the top two is you got the cost and benefit of using. And you list all the costs of using. And on the other side, all the benefits of using. And at the bottom is all the costs of not using and all the benefits of not using. And for example, for example, a, uh, a cost of using, it could be a hangover, it could be law, it could be um, money. The benefits of using, maybe you were a better dancer or you were more, source, uh, uh, more social. And of not using the cost, well, you'll have to deal with life on life's terms sometimes. Then the benefits of not using, well, you get more better health. Um, you have better relationships with your family. So that's the cost benefit analysis in a short one. Number three, it's called the DEADS tool. 